Welcome, today we're going to learn how to make circus animal wax melts. You can pause the screen to take a screenshot of the supplies we'll be using today. I'll place my pitchfork on the digital scale, then press the tear button to zero the weight out. Next, I'll add one pound of wax. After I finish weighing my wax, then I'm going to take my little tree cake fragrance oil and add 10% fragrance load. You can pause this screen to take a screenshot of the simple formula how to calculate how much fragrance oil to add into your wax. For best results, I like to melt my wax to 225, add my fragrance oil, and stir for 60 seconds. Then I'll take my Dixie cup, sprinkle a little pink candle dyed chips, then add my little tree cake fragrance oil. After I'm finished, I'll take my Dixie cup, stir it with my wooden stir stick, and then place it to the side. While it's setting there, I'll take my rainbow nonpareils and sprinkle it inside each animal mold. Just a quick tip, make sure your table is level when you're sprinkling the rainbow nonpareils. Then take your wax and pour it in the silicone mold. I decided I wanted to add some white mica, so I took coconut kisses, which is a white mica, and I added just a smidgel. I kept stirring very well, and then you can add until you reach your desired shade but try not to add too much because mica is very heavy. Then I took my Dixie cup and I poured the remaining wax into the additional animal molds. After four hours later, now it was ready to demold. I love C55 Coconut Luxury Tart Wax. It is formulated specifically for wax melts and it has a smooth and creamy finish. If you're thinking about learning how to make wax melts, I highly recommend it has an amazing hot throw. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit the subscribe button, like, and share, and also join our Facebook group, Learn the Basics of Wax Melts. See you next time.